Hi boys and girls, I'm Mrs Edmonds and um, I thought I'd read you a story today. The story I've chosen is by one of my favourite authors and she's called Julia Donaldson. So you might have already heard of her because she's done lots of amazing books. So today I want to read to you Superworm. Okay. See if you can hear the words that rhyme. So like long and strong both end in ong. See if you can hear any other words that rhyme. Superworm is super long. Superworm is super strong. Watch him wiggle, see him squirm. Hip hip hooray for Superworm. Help, disaster, baby toad has hopped onto a major road. Quick, whatever can we do? Look, a superworm lasso. The bees are feeling bored today. They need a nice new game to play. Cheer up bees, no need to mope. It's superworm, the skipping rope. Beetles fallen in the well. Is she drowning? Who can tell? Not to panic, all is fine. It's superworm, the fishing line. Then toads and beetles, bees and bugs, brother snails and sister slugs, uncle ant and earwig aunt, clip and cheer and chant this chant. Superworm is super long. Superworm is super strong. Watch him wiggle, see him squirm. Hip hip hooray for Superworm! The chant is carried on the air to wizard lizard in his lair. He mutters in his servant's ear, find that worm and bring him here. The servant crow is black and grim. Everyone is scared of him. They all let out a fearful shriek to see their hero in his beak. The wizard waves his magic flower. Now, superworm, you're in my power. And you must tunnel, writhe and coil to find me treasure in the soil. Superworm is very cross to have a lizard as his boss. But when he tries to slink away, the wizard's magic makes him stay. For days he tunnels, twists and turns. But all the treasure he finds is two small buttons, half a cork, a toffee and a plastic fork. The lizard flicks an angry tail. Have one last try and if you fail to find that treasure down below, I'll feed you to my hungry crow. The crow is flapping through the night. Everyone looks up in fright. They see him perch upon an oak and listen to his dreadful croak. Superworm is good to eat. Superworm's a special treat. He'll be juicy, fat and firm. Hip, hip, hooray for Superworm. Action, quickly, at the double. Superworm's in frightful trouble. We must help him if we can. We must hatch a cunning plan. The garden creatures leave their home, carrying a honeycomb. They jump and fly and crawl and creep. They chew oh no, and find the lizard fast asleep. They chew the petals off his flower to rob him of his magic power. The caterpillars fetch some leaves while busily spider weaves. The web is strong, the web is tough, the web is plenty big enough. The wizard wakes. This isn't funny. I'm wrapped in leaves and stuck with honey. Can't be <laughs> then up the bees and beetles fly and lift the web into the sky. This is the place and bang, crash, thump. The wizard is in the rubbish dump. And now from somewhere underground, there comes a distant rumbling sound. The earth begins to heave and then... Superworm is back again! Superworm.
worm, the swing, the slide, the hula hoop, the fairground ride. Super worm, the belt, the hat, the crane, the train, the acrobat. Then toads and beetles, bees and bugs, brother snails and sister slugs, uncle ant and earwig aunt, clap and cheer and chant this chant. Super worm is super long, super worm is super strong. Watch him wiggle, see him squirm, hip hip hooray for super worm. And that's the end of my story. Now, if you enjoyed my super worm story, I thought you might like to use some Play-Doh and roll your own worms with the Play-Doh. See if you can make some short worms and some long worms. See what the longest worm you can roll with your Play-Doh is. Maybe you could get a ruler or a tape measure and measure how long they are. It's a bit tricky at the moment but even just comparing which one's the shortest and then getting the next longest and the next longest and the longest and putting them in order make as many worms as you can you could count your worms you could make different color worms and put all the same colors together so I hope you have fun making lots of worms. You might even like to go outside and go on a bug hunt and see if you can find your own worms outside. But hold them carefully and look after them because we want to keep the super worms safe, don't we? Okay, I hope you enjoyed my story. Bye.